Alright, so this is going to be another television show review. This one's called Adventures of Superman. I had this on my Netflix queue about five years ago. At that time, they only had seasons one through four, I believe. Um, so I had to add seasons five and six later on. Um, so right now, I'm watching season five, which is the color version. I and um, this is starring George Reeves. There's a lot of speculation of, about his death, that he might have been shot um, by a jealous former girlfriend or the jealous former girlfriend's husband. Um, I guess he was getting ready. Uh, I was reading about him, and he was supposed to get married. Um, they were supposed to do another season, and then all of a sudden he shot himself. At least that's the official story. Uh, but like I said, there's speculation, conspiracy theories. My uh, my uncle's girlfriend or my uncle's um, wife or whatever she is, uh, she she said that George Reeves was gay. I, I never heard that before. I, she must have him mixed up with somebody else. I don't know what she's talking about, but um, anyway. Um, first season was great. I mean, it's uh, it's very noirish, kind of adult type of theme, and I guess that's why they toned it down, made made it more like a kids type show. Um, when I was growing up as a kid in the '70s, this show was on constantly. Uh, reruns, and they used, they would even uh, mix together the uh, the black and white and the color episodes. So, um, so I loved this show when I was a kid. I used to have a soup, um, a garbage can when I was in preschool that had uh, the first Superman comic and the first Batman comic. Um, I think it was Action Comics from the 30s or something. Uh, those, those comic books are worth a, a lot of money now. I even collected comic books when I was a kid, but I never collected Superman. I was more... I was more into the uh, Frank Miller uh, Dark Knight hysteria of the 80s. I think it was late 80s um, when that came out. I never really collected Superman. I was more of a Marvel Comics guy. And Superman was DC Comics. I never collected too many DC Comics. My cousin liked DC Comics. I always liked Marvel Comics for some reason. Um, I like Spider-Man and uh, Iron Man, uh, X-Men, those kind of comic books. Yeah, they later became uh, blockbuster movies. And... Um, the only DC comic that I really collected was Dark Knight, like I said. Um, so, getting back to um, Adventures of Superman. Um, yeah, this is, um, this is a great uh, TV show. Gave it five stars on Netflix and and I recommend every season. I mean, um, I loved this as a kid. I still love it today as an adult. And uh, I even used to say, look up in the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane. And uh, I think Method Man uh, used that line in one of his uh, hip hop songs from 93 or something. Um, yeah, so the introduction is great. Uh, I'll post the intro on in the uh, in the um, description box down here, and uh, well, uh, yeah, Superman fights for truth, justice, and the American way. Right on. I uh, love that that intro with the American flag. That's great. I mean, oh. Uh, I wish I could have lived in the 50s, man. That was a great decade with Eisenhower. And then, um, yeah, definitely fun times. Uh, I love 
I love this TV show. I can't say enough good things about it. It's probably the best uh, TV show from the 50s. Anyway, um, that's my review. And have a great day. I'm going to watch Franklin now, and that will be my next review. Late.